All right, so two truly elite strikers here. We sat down with them on Thursday and asked them, any thoughts of taking this fight to the ground? They want to strike. They want to strike. That's what got them to the show. That is the path that they are normally on. And tonight they get someone that allows them to fight in their comfort zone. They don't have to worry about defending takedowns. All they have to worry about is who can rely on their knowledge in the striking to carry them to victory. Big ball for punch land. Now he gets back to range. Just misses there with the left. All right, so a nice shot there defensively to raise the guard and prevent any damage. Those hands never leave where they're supposed to be. And if you do that, most times you will block the shot that's incoming. Well, perhaps a sign of things to come as he lands a kick there. Nice kick landed by the judge. Oh! He needs to start looking to finish now because he's got his opponent hurt very bad. Oh! Well, he's doing a nice job keeping the guard up, but that usually means the body is wide open, and his opponent wisely saw that and landed the straight hand to the body. Let's see if he shows some things up here defensively to prevent that fate moving forward. He has a commitment to kicking tonight, and it shows. Clipped him with the right hand there. Just missed with the left there. Big punch lands over the top. How's he gonna follow this one? Two minutes now to go. Good job keeping that head up. The biggest shot that he's landed all night. A massive uppercut lane. Nice counter shot there. Well done to block that powerful kick to the bottom. Oh, and there's a land with the kick, so certainly a good sign for him there. When that's working, you know he's in for a good night. Under a minute now to go round one. Look at how he turns his hip into that leg kick. Able to check the high kick. Nice punch lands over the top. Twenty seconds to go in round one. Just what a fantastic strike to throw at the exact right moment. What a fight so far. Right, so there is the horn at times in that previous round. I didn't think we'd get here after that head kick nearly had him out of there. It was a good round leading up to that. But when you take a head kick like that, when your opponent gets your entire body into that kick, usually the night's over. Very tough to still be. All right, here we go with round two. So he's really starting to put together some significant body shots here. These are going to take their toll as this fight goes on. There's no tell on that leg kick. Yeah, he's mixed it all up. Oh, big punch lands. Oh, that right hand is on point. What a body kick. Uppercut attempt nearly connects, but no good. Oh, man, how is he standing? Brutal knee to the body. Oh, straight right. Well, he's been pretty accurate tonight. He's landed some significant strikes, but his corner's looking for him to mix it up a little bit more and just throw more volume. Because they don't see too much of a threat. This guy has to have confidence in knowing that when he extends his combinations, He's still safe, but he's also going to be able to land. He's got to be finding that confidence in his mind that all the reps in the training room are going to pay off. Continues to mix it up, going to the head, mixing in some body shots. 
Oh, great head movement there. Slips his head off the center line, and defensively, that's exactly what you're looking for. It's almost like he can telegraph when the punch is coming. And when he sees it, he just makes a slight little movement, right or left, to get out of the way and avoid those shots. Oh, he lands another strike to the body, really starting to connect on a lot of shots to the midsection. And these will take their toll as this fight goes into the ladder rounds. That's a big strike right there. Nice jab by him there. He's going nose hunting tonight, huh? Yeah, he's great with the jab. And not only as a setup, he really is trying to get damage off every time he throws this punch. Oh, he hurt a bad with the jab. Straight punch land. Oh, nice combination of strikes there. In terms of the accuracy, I mean, that's exactly what a coach is looking for. That's exactly. It's like the guy is hitting pads. It's like he's hitting focus mitts, but instead, he's dancing all over his opponent's face. Well, his corner was pretty urgent after round one. Little bit lackluster there in that opening round. He has certainly picked up the pace here, and as a result, he has taken control of this second round. Big body kick land. Oh, is that a big knee to the body? We'll see if he can follow up. Chance coming in, big knockdown for him in the previous round. DC talking to the highlight. He got in his opponent's feet. Sound defense there as he blocks the shot. Oh, just digs into the box. He's shot in every part of himself, and now he's got his opponent hurt. Straight right. Yes, they heard him in the last round. Same exact one. What a punch. Well, we'll see if he can turn this defense into offense, but he's doing a great job blocking shots here tonight. As of right now, he's thinking more deficiently, and he's doing a great job of not taking any damage. And they separate. And a nice left hand there. Arrow on the ropes there, DC. He's rocked. That was a beautiful hook. It landed perfectly. And it hurt him the whole very bad. I mean, the strike lands there, so he did hit the desired target, but it almost looked like slow motion to me. Yeah, he's moving in slow motion. He's throwing everything at his opponent, and he couldn't get him out of there. Now it's just a matter of trying to survive and not get knocked out himself. Unable to connect with the right. Well, it's all pace and pressure down the stretch. He is really lighting him up now. Ooh-wee! Ooh-wee, what a right hand by this young man. Oh, big head kick there. Knee to the body. Oh. He didn't like that left hand. Nice job to block the kick. Oh man, this guy kicks like a mule. Wow! And just like that, the fight is over. He got him! You knew if he landed that weapon repeatedly, it could be a short night for his opponent.